isn't gonna end. So this is one of the end Magnus you were talking about? She's totally gonna side with the evil empire. <gasps> oh my! Who said oh my? Someone did. Whoa! You're... Uh, we better get that back to Callus right now. Callus is, you know, immune to evil things, apparently. I wonder what the queen could have seen. Someone exploding? Who knows? I know! The end Magnus did that to her. It can't be pretty. I agree. Do you think she'll be alright? The queen's on fire! She's graceful. Queen Corellia has a strong mind. The willpower of several men. Or so I hear. But apparently not as much as Callus, because Callus was able to just go, Meh, I'm gonna shove this here thingy in my pocket. Whatever the end Magnus has shown her, I doubt it could damage her seriously. She now yeah. has schizophrenia. Hey, Savino. Why don't you tell us about yourself? The where's and what's from before you came here. Hmm? Hmm? What made you come here to Anue Nue? I'm all ears if you feel like talking. Hey, don't worry. I'm not suspicious of you. Not Just suspicious curious. at all. If you don't want to talk, and trust me, Gabari probably me. wouldn't be. I drifted around from place to place, usually as a mercenary. Protecting towns and caravans, that was more or less the life I was living for years. Then okay. one day I came across a strange old woman. Her name? was Aunt Jemima. Heed my word. Oh, it's this crazy lady. The we talked to her in freaking... Island. What's it called, didn't we? Is host to a dreadful power hidden deep within its core. <laughs> Before long, you will That's really weird music there. In a great struggle over this power. The struggle alone will fill a great emptiness within you and ease your pain on you and you will this lady's you. evil you must go go and face your destiny which involves getting beat up by a blue haired dude with one wing if you wish to return to the life you once lived as your own person <laughs> so I thought I might as well go see this tree she spoke of. I was headed nowhere. A soldier for hire, living an empty life one day after the next. It was easy to make such decisions at that time. I hardly had a care in this world. So, this old lady told you we'd be coming? No. Well, yes. Yes. A dreadful uh, power really. lies sealed away within the celestial tree. A young girl and her companions, shouldering a great burden, will arrive to claim it. That's how she put it. She's also she also started cackling about some evil god and how she was totally not going to destroy the world if you burden. grabbed all these evil powers. Oh, don't know anybody like that. You're a little strange yourself, following a strange old lady's fortune and coming down here to live alone? It's quite strange. Nothing mattered. Hmm? Hmm? Nothing really mattered to me. Nothing at all. Lies. I was just waiting. Waiting for so long. But waiting for, for what? fate to open its doors and show me something worth fighting for. Oh. Oh, hi guys. Um, Queen Corellia has regained consciousness. It only she took three days. To with <laughs> Queen's gone completely mad, bonkers, insane now. She's probably in her bedroom. Running to her room. Yep. 
You! Hand me back the card! How do you feel, your highness? I am all right. My apologies for worrying you. It seems what you told me about the legends in Diadem were indeed true. If that's the case, I'm afraid you must die. I'm sorry I doubted you. <laughs> Please don't worry about it, your highness. Wow, we're 37 minutes already. No one would have believed <clears throat> such a wild story out of the blue like that. What? Empire? The e obviously evil empire attacking some small town? It's pretty believable. But is Emperor Geldoblame really trying to release that being? Yes. It's very likely. Two of the N Magnus have already been released. Well, make that three. You held the thir you hold the third one in your hands and it made you pass out. The only pl safe place for that N Magnus is Callus's pants. His jean pocket, or whatever the kind of the Magnus thing he's wearing. He brought here. It's very dangerous. If the Emperor Callus should eat it. all five of them and release their power. Malpercio, cursed god of old, might be resurrected. Replace might with wood and you have the plot to this game. Malpercio, resurrected. Her, him, it Should thing. Should Malpercio return, our world would be in great peril. Okay. I will send a messenger to King Ladikan right away. To discuss what action should be taken. That will not the be necessary. The combined might of Anuanue and Diadem should be enough to keep the Empire at bay. If only our soldiers would get out of bed in the morning. That would help greatly. We must do our utmost to stop Geldoblame while there's still time. Not happening. Three of the five N Magnus have been awakened. R, Lay, and, and Che. che. The one we names. have is called Che. Che. Two more to go. Cal yep. I say we go get the fourth one. We can't change what's happened. All we can do is find the other two and grab them before the Empire does. Rays of light shooting from the Magnus pointed in two directions. Mira and the Empire. Which of oh, those should we head for first? I say Mira. Infiltrating the Empire would be too risky at this point. Oddly enough, I agree with you, because I was going to say Mira myself. I'll be coming with you, of course. Soldiers can't leave the front lines in the middle of an operation. Besides... I still don't trust you. This fight... Thanks! You'll be a great help... Shella! <laughs> Yet another joins the motley crew. The one I have to admit... <laughs> I'm thinking of the band. Much. Stop whining, kid. This story is just a huge you allegory for how Motley Crue crew. was formed. Of course, we don't even know what your plans are. My plans? Okay, okay. Well, yes, you know I'm my plans. To. Find Giacomo, stab him in the face, repeat as necessary. If only Giacomo would do me a favor and pop up again. <laughs> Save me the trouble of hunting him down. Speaking of that... <laughs> By the way, our next destination, Mira... What exactly are we in for? Aren't you like some scholar dude from the Empire? You should know exactly Mira what's going on. Is the city of Illusion. So a it's the mage's place. Land. Its location shifts from time to time. Not really. Going back and forth between our world and another dimension. Or so and they say. Take the trail of souls there, a border between dimensions. But you should all get some rest before departure. Yes. Rest in our Thank beds. You, Your Highness. I, for one, will take you up on that offer. What you have accomplished was no easy feat. Can we have our special fancy no card back now? Maybe even more I want to hope it's a weapon. And this is where everything goes to shit. The castle's on fire! Card, now. Valuables. Is it in our valuables? Oh, it is. Hmm. Che is the end, apparently.
I assume we rested, so we walk away. We just like passed out on the floor, I guess. Surprise, we're gonna get mugged by the Empire. We have to. It's kind of the theme of this game. Get awesome power, get mugged by Empire. These guys are so totally gonna die. Eventually. Alright, to the port. Get on our elephant boat. So, we'll be heading for Mirith. I guess so. Sure! I have no qualms with that plan. Flying away! Looks a little blurry on the screen here. Eh, whatever. Now departing for Mirith. Make sure your seatbelts are in the on position. Dee 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 dee. Ah! Rainbows. Shpa. No wonder they put an epilepsy warning on things nowadays. Oh, wait, we're from Mira. Say, why don't we take a stroll around the ship? It's getting pretty stuffy in here. Let's go. All right, cool. Oh, talk to Liud for a second. I wonder why they never came after us back in Anue Anue. I wonder why. I think they would be chomping at the bit to get the end magnus. They need all five for the Emperor's plans, don't they? I know exactly what they're doing, I guess. Don't Probably ask me. right. Maybe they don't need to worry about us anymore. Uh no. Maybe. One of us is an Imperial spy. Yes. We're looking at you, Liud. This is no laughing matter. I can't help but wonder about Savina. She just seems a little Something's not right. Something's not right about you either, Liu. I know what you're getting at. She is a little on the shady side. I'll give you that. But I'm not too sure about you either. Nor am I. I don't blame you. Until recently, I was indeed an Imperial officer. What do you think? Do you trust me? Not entirely. I don't trust you. Huh. That's so. I don't trust him either. <laughs> Really? Nope. <laughs> Callus, we've been through this already. Shelly, you're too trusting. I believe in you, Lewd. They're just edgy. Never mind what they say. <laughs> uh, sometimes it's fun Thank going you, with Callus's thoughts. Because Callus is a douchebag. <laughs> Did you hear that? She makes us sound like the bad guys. We're awesome. But we're smart. Come on. He did betray us. Oh, I just noticed this, but Callus' hair moves when you spin. Um. Should talk to the stupid thing. Well, I'm gonna go over here then. He can puke on the carpet, not my shoe. I mean, what would we ever do without Callus' delightfully blue Crocs? Alright, um. Yeah. So apparently we're from Mira. I don't know what else. What do you have to say? Now what I think is happening is uh I'm gonna chat with the others. Oh, special cutscene. What's wrong, Callus? You look a little down. I'm from Mira. I hate being cramped up in small rooms. I'm in a fresh air. Besides, I always get a little clammy. Because you're secretly soulless. We don't have much of a choice now, anyway. How are you 
doing? Not bad. Well, there isn't much we can do until we reach Mira. Yeah, I suppose you're right. I'm not bad. I ain't the one passing through magical rainbow land. Okay, so I guess that's all that's left now is to talk to... What's her face? Oh, damn, there's a boss fight. <sighs> Always a boss fight. There's going to be like two boss fights in this episode alone. Alright. Alright, let's get this over with. Now, but what I think the Empire's doing is uh, letting us gather all the cards and then they're just going to punk them off us when they're done. Really. It's common. Well, okay, Sabina. No offense, but I don't totally believe your story. I'd say the others feel the same way. Good. Figures. But it's not important. I don't care whether you believe me or not. Just don't stand in my way. Friend or foe, stand in my way, and I'll take you out. Uh, we kicked your ass hard last time you we fought. You my story, but you best believe my warning for your own good. <laughs> you barely stood a chance. Hey, just because I don't fully trust you, it's not like I hate you. 